Eh karibu afrika sana sana na naye. Nataka niende hapo kwenye mall yake. Ni mall ni nyumba yake ile. <laughs> ha? Kubwa sana. Nimekuuliza swali ile ni mall ni nyumba yake? Ni mall nyumba. Mmoja anaita mall. Eh ni nyumba yake. Yeah. Zitek. You know Kali he's Zitek. my Yeah 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 he's my brother so Mambo vipi ndugu watazamaji tuko hapa uh, Joma Kenyatta International Airport na tumekuja kumlucky the one and only Vivan boy all the way from Tanzania tunataka kupiga story na yetu jua safari imekuwaje na safari yake kusafiri hadi huko Nairobi Mombasa ni juu ya kufanya nini Vivan boy mambo vipi Poa oh, mzima. Kwa salama. I am good. Karibu sana Kenya. Asante sana. Niko nyumbani. Najua huku ni nyumbani. Yeah. <laughs> Safari imekuwa yes. vipi? Ilikuwa poa sana uh -huh. na tumefika salama so God is good. Mhm. Uh -huh. Yeah. Labda kwa ufupi utueleze umefika huku Nairobi tu ajao uko na show Mombasa. Labda yeah. tueleze kidogo about the show. Yeah, I'm so excited. Show iko tarehe 9 mwezi wa 12 Mombasa Sports Club if I'm not mistaken. Yeah. Zijam uh, shout out to Ziki lakini pesa taka peke yangu nitakuwa na Otile na wasanii wengine pia wa wa, wa hapa Kenya so ni muda mrefu sana sijaenda Mombasa sija perform Kenya so I'm so excited na wa Kenya ni watu ambao na support sana Rayvanny so mimi ni super perform itakuwa mbaya sana ndio maana nikasema okay that's good for me to perform na niimbe kwa ajili ya mashabiki zangu wa Mombasa na Nairobi pia wanaweza wakaja so I'm ready tarehe 9 mwezi wa 12 9th of December. Choi tunaelewa wakeka acha nimalize. Tumeona wasanii wakeka red card zao kwenye yeah. concert events. Labda yeah. Chui amefika wapi? Hii yeah. show umepewa mangapi hivi? <laughs> ah uh, sio vizuri sana kuongea lakini uh, Mungu Mungu mwema kadri miaka inavyozidi kwenda mambo yanabadilika so Tuko vizuri. Tuko vizuri. So vizuri kuongea. Yeah. Ah, chui sawa. Yeah. Chui, you have a new EP. Yeah. Five for you. Yeah. Oh, Actually it's not yeah. EP. Uh-huh. Lakini ni nyimbo tano tu. Tano tu, five for you. Yes, Mbona so. pale umeimba nyimbo inaitwa Wababa? Yeah. <laughs> Unata unaangazia kina nani? Wababa? Eh. <laughs> okay, nikuuliza wewe sasa. Eh. <laughs> wewe unachagua nani? U kijana au mbaba? <laughs> Chui Wewe zaza <laughs> Swali ngumu hilo lakini yeah, Swali na kwa gumu kwa sababu Unajua sponsors au wababa wana Saidia Dada zetu So nikasema ok Mina pia nafanya ideas to photo fauti So yeah Tuko na video tayari ya uimbo So tukitoa video watu watayelewa zaidi Tuko na manisha nini kusema wababa Yeah so ni idea idea tofauti tu. Eh, kuna changamoto pale kwenye EP watu wamesema kuna watu ambao mm. wa, wamejulikana Tanzania mm. kama maybe week moja iliyopita. Mm. Uliwajua before ama umewajua sai? Kina nani? Eh, the five guys wenye wameimba the last song. Oh. Uh, oh, not are you talking about two guys yeah, or five guys? Two guys, guys two guys actually. They are my friends. Mm. They are my friends from Angola. Mm -hmm. Pia kuna Matias Damasio, uh -huh. one of the biggest yeah, yeah. from Angola. Uh -huh. Pia kuna Jerry Son Israel, uh -huh. my brother, tulifanya wimbo mmoja pia. Uh -huh. Na mini mtu ambaye nafanya kolabu na wasani tufotofauti, kutoka uh -huh. same tufotofauti uh -huh. duniani. So, uh -huh. so after five for you, I think I'm going to come with something called Global Way. Uh -huh. yeah, itakuwa na features tufotofauti zaidi kutoka same tufotofauti duniani. So, au ni ambao ni meanza nao tu kutoka Angola. Uh -huh. It's a love song. Like in particular, now we're going to find na um, na Laxiel, na na Ricardo Ban, mm -hmm. uh, my lady. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So we're going to go to photo photos. We're going to find videos to photo photos. We're going to find. We're going to find Christmas. Mm -hmm. Of course, to na video to add a Christmas. So what I'm going to do is going to find Christmas. No, no, no. So we're going to find like a piano type of songs. We're going to. I need photo photos of music. So. That's five for you. Yeah. Different type of song. Yeah. On top of that, CEO, kwanza mimi na respect kitu ambacho unakifanya. Yeah. Naheshimu sana nizamu yako katika kazi ndao staff. Mm -hmm. Lakini natamani mm -hmm. kufahamu mm -hmm. hizi ngoma tano ambazo umeziachia. Sio yeah. EP, sio album, sio yeah. nini. Umeachia ngoma mfululizo, wenyewe anaitwa mfululu. Yeah. Eh yeah. kiasi kwamba uh, baadhi ya mashabiki zako tumepata kushangaa na kuaje? Mbona haraka hivi ngoma tano? On top of that kuna mtu anaitwa Miso Misondo, moja kati ya madije ambao yeah. anatrend yeah. sana sisi oh, Tanzania. Man. Na uh, saa tatu umetrade Eh, Miso Misondo, yeah. sadatu mitoidi kitu kizito kina kuja yeah. Yeah. Sisa nataka kufahamu, kwa nini Miso Misondo? Kusabu wana trend au ni kama kawidago kuinua vipaji and all stuff? Uh, Swala so sio kwa sababu tu ana trend 
kitu chochote ambacho unaona kimependwa mm. maana ni kitu kizuri kama uliona watu walikuwa wamjui lakini alifanya vitu vyake watu wakaza kumfuatilia mm. vile ambavyo watu walipenda na mimi kitu ambacho nimependa na mimi waga sipendaki kujificha i'm very open sure. nikikipenda kitu na nafanya ndio niko hivyo waga sijali eti wewe msanii gani kafika wapi nikishaona tu huyu anafaa anafanya naye misu misondo ni pro, ni ni DJ mm. uh, wa wa vijijini huko kuna sehemu moja hapa naitwa sikumbuki jina vizuri yeah, like point, point yeah. Point. Yeah. Uh, niliona baada ya kuona vitu vyake nikamcheki yeah. wewe zamini nilimcheki DM vipi fresh power yeah send me some beats nitumie beats uh, tunaweza tukafanya kitu akanitumia nikasema okay kwa type ya mziki wake tunaweza tukachanganya na vitu vyangu tukapata kitu kizuri kwa hiyo mimi naenda kuangalia vitu vyangu sababu nilimuona tu niliona clip yake muda sana mm. sasa wakati mimi naenda kufanya kazi nikaona kila sehemu wanapostiwa nikasema okay kumbe mimi nilipenda kitu ambacho hata watu wengine wanafanyaje wanapenda so tuka plan kwao ni mbali sana kule wapi masasi mm. so tulisafiri tukaenda hadi kushoot video kule kwao so tusha shoot video kila kitu kipo tayari uh, kodi kila kitu bro kwa watu ambao wanafuatia wana, wana, wana Rayvani mm. saa tatu ya leo tunaachia video mm. ya kitu kizito ni sound ya nyumbani kabisa ni sound ya kitanzania kabisa yani acha sio mapiano sio vitu gani lakini ni sound ambayo ya, ya nyumbani moves zile dance za nyumbani so ni kitu ambacho kina, kina promote pia culture ya nyumbani so about miso misondo mm. saa tatu tunachia video lakini video zingine zinaendelea kutoka pia ongera kwa creativity umepokea zawadi tatu yeah. wewe mbili na mke mmoja Eh, una una se, u, ulisama pale hao wengine wamepokea zawadi kulingana yeah. wamekuwa wakifanya yeah. kitu inaitwa collabs lakini wewe yeah. kabisa unaimba nyimbo za kitanzania yeah. una yeye pia kusema mimi kila ambapo napata zawadi au tuzo uoga inanipa nguvu sana kwamba nifanye kazi kwa bidii ili niweze kuzipata zingine zaidi yani nifanye video ya forever na my baby mama my love you know Faivani Faima na imekuwa very successful kwa sababu tumepata tuzo tofauti tofauti. Yeah, moja tumepata kutoka New Jersey. Yeah, oh, no no no, sorry, Florida, Florida. Yeah. So tumepata lakini nyingine tumepata kutoka Zambia. Yeah. Ni kitu kikubwa sana kwangu mimi kwamba nafanya kazi na watu wanaipokea. Na hivi tumetoa video nyingine tena mwambieni. Inafanya vizuri uh, kwa hiyo ni kitu kizuri kwangu kinanipa moyo wa kuendelea kufanya kazi. Talking yeah. of Ivani, mlirudiana na baby mama and we yeah. understand sasa hizi mambo iko sawa. Labda tell us a little bit kidogo maisha iko waje after kurudiana. Pia tuliona pale umesema hamtaachana tena. Mko pamoja kabisa. Ah uh, namshukuru Mungu kwamba tunaenda vizuri. Ya yeah, tuko na wagombana sana mwanzo. Lakini sasa hivi tunaenda vizuri. Yeah. Nataka kuja vizuri. kurealize ni kitu gani kilikuwa kinaleta utata kati yako na baby mm. mama. Sasa unapoongea hapo unatengeneza mazingira nianze kuongea. <laughs> Kuna muda mwingine niyo emotional nianze kulia. <laughs> yes, lakini so lakini, no. lakini uh, I'm so happy. You have to know that I'm so happy. Mm. Lakini sita kwenda deep sana kuongea. Ya yeah. kwa sababu so, tunapitia moments tofauti. So, Unaweza kuanza kulia au kuanza kufanyaje? <laughs> Oh sorry. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. Chui chui swali jingine la msingi, uh, umeonekana ukiwa unafanya show mfululizo lakini pia ukaribu wako sasa na Harmonize. Uh, ume, umetengeneza trend kwa watazamaji wengi, kwa mashabiki wengi wa Harmonize, wa Rivani, wa Next Level, wa Konde Gang and all stuff. Lakini ukaribu wako pia umetengeneza attention kwa baadhi ya watu ambao wanao kuchukulieni ndikuwa tofauti wakati tofauti pia zinaisha. Nimekuwa na mfululizo ukiwa unafanya show mfululizo lakini pia juzi ulikuwa kwa Mheshimiwa Mchangelo. Yeah. Ongera sana na show ilienda exactly. vizuri nimeiona ile show. Exactly. Lakini kutokuepo kwako kwa Safi Festival Dodoma yeah. watu pia wakawa wanasema eh inakuaje kwa sababu yeah. ya Konde Boy na Rivani kwa pamoja au inakuaje? Tukutegemee kwenye Safi Festival zinazokuja. Ah uh, unajua kila show unayoiona mimi uh, inakuwa ni ratiba. Kwa sababu mimi napenda kufanya show ambayo nimeandaa. Mm. Niandae set ya kuperform mm. sio tu nipande na mic sie ye yeah, anishuke no I don't do that. Mm kona anda kila kitu tunachokifanya. Kwa ukiona kwenye show nimeenda maana yake ratiba yangu na show usika viliendana. Uh, wasafi ni familia. So Diamond is my brother. Ndio maana niona kwenye shows tofauti tofauti na tumekuwa tunafanya creativities tofauti tofauti. Ambapo unaniona sijakuepo maana yake 
it was not planned lakini sio kwamba wasafi wamenuna au si tuna ugomvi no it's not like that na speaking about harmonize vitu vinaendaga lakini kuna time nafika vinaisha muona mm-hmm. mnakuwa na kuna sometimes mtu akijua kwamba bana hapa nilikosea na we don't have to do it anymore na we unabidi uelewe kwamba okay kuna leo kuna kesho tuko na generation zetu pia mimi na mtoto amnaiza na mtoto hatuwezi kuweka au maugomvi mpaka huko mbele so tunafika time tunaona kwamba okay nafikiri enough is enough tuongezee kwa hiyo raivani labda inakufanya una feel aje ukisikia kuwa watu wanasema of course you still doing an amazing job lakini mm. sahii unasikia kwenye comment section mm. unasema to toka rivani atoke wasafi nyimbo zake azisikiki sana mm. unasikia watu wakisema hivyo labda at some point ukisikia hivyo una feel aje unajua sasa unashinda kuelewa mm. the day unapokuwa umetoa umetoa wimbo au umetoka maana ya kwanza umekuwa superstar mm. nilipotoka tu watu wengi wakasema msanii wa kawaida sana mm. amna kitu hapo hata video yangu ya kwanza nimetoka itafute kwetu sasa hivi. Kasome comment. Wengine wanakuambia mbaya. Kuna wengine watakwambia nzuri. Kwa hiyo maneno yapo siku zote, lakini mimi nikikuuliza wewe. Wewe unaonaje? Uko sawa? Yes. So ni comments tu watu wanaongea. Yeah. Akaswali tu hapa. Tunaona yeah. kongole kwanza kwa tuzo zako ambazo mshinda. Uh, yeah, asante sana. Congratulations pia yeah. for the nomination ya Grammy. Oh, no, thanks a lot. Yeah, being uh, the, the only yeah. East African artist I think. Sorry, hold on. Umesikia huko? Mm-hmm. Huyo msanii ambaye toka ametoka huko <laughs> wana wanampongeza kwa Grammy. Yeah. You see? <laughs> okay, endelea. <Yeah. laughs> Congratulations sisi kama wa Kenya on yeah. behalf of Kenya can yeah. uh, confirm that you are so uh, proud of you for the yeah. nomination thanks of Grammy. And uh, so do you when Zapo alikuja VIP being uh, on the premanisha sana na uh, na wako Simba yeah. uh, for the nomination kwa sababu ya bado na mm. pia ilikuwa ombi lake sana mm. uh, kuwe na Grammy ambayo inakuja eh, eh, Tanzania lakini sisi tunasema East Africa kweli tuko na wewe kweli yeah, kama ni mwenzetu sana uh, first of all uh, unaichukulia VIP being the only uh, East African artist ambaye ame win ile amepewa ile nomination ya Grammy yeah. yon swali ya kwanza uh, la pili E, tumeona pale mkakutana na kakako harmonize yeah. na kuna zandani zile ya kwamba uh, kunaweza kuwa na mziki kazi ambayo yeah. inatokea na pia i'm very sure kuna kazi ambazo mlikuwa mmezifanya na harmonize ambazo hazikuwa itoka mtoa pale wasafi yeah. you have the right to release them ama mkataba mm. ukubali kwanza naanzia swali loishia mwisho hatujaifanyaga kazi zingine ambazo zilikuwa wasafi na hazikutoka cha kwanza hatukuwepo nayo mpaka muda huu lakini mimi na harmonize tunaongea. Na ngoma tunaweza tukafanya muda wote kutoka sasa hivi kwa sababu tunaongea na tunashare miziki kila siku. So kuhusu hilo so muda mrefu tunaweza tukatoa wimbo wa pamoja. Anything can happen. Lakini kuhusu Grammy mimi nitaongelea kwenye tofauti sana. Nda ku nda ku correct hapo. Wasanii wengi sana wanakuwa nominated kwa Grammy kwa kupitia kazi tofauti tofauti ambazo wanakuwa wameshirikishwa. Ishatokea Nandi, nafikiri ishatokea Diamond pia. Alishirikishwa kwenye nafikiri albamu ya Alisha Kizi from No Mistake. Lakini mimi ni Maluma na wimbo ni Tetema, ambao ni Mama Tetema. Ambao ni typical sound ya huku tumefanya kuanzia then from the scratch kuanzia na production yetu kila kitu chetu so kuwa nominated kwenye Grammy ni kitu kikubwa sana kwa sababu producer anatokea East Africa. Kwa hiyo ni kubwa sana kwa East Africa ndio maana tunaita ni yaki pekee. Na mimi na 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 na, 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 na amini, mambo mengi mazuri yanakuja na nashukuru Mungu kwamba vitu vingi waga vinakuja na watu wanaviona. Mimi kwangu waga na furai kwa sababu Mungu waga anafanya vitu vingi sana vya tofauti ambavyo watu wengi pengine hawajakutana navyo na mimi sio kama na bahati sana lakini mimi waga ninashukuru tu kwamba vinatokea ila maneno mtu ku criticize mtu kuongea ni vitu vya kawaida sana ila mimi you know I'm always grateful uh, God is good yeah. Yeah. Tumiona, Yeah. Uh, ni kitu ambacho uh, kwa watu wengi ilikuwa ni surprise sana because uh, mm. tuliona wewe ukiendea tuzo yako kwa kwa harmonize yeah. ndio wakati uh, mm. 
Yeah. How do you feel that uh, now the father congratulating the, mm. the sons? Wacha kwa pamoja na kuambia anafurahia sana kuona mtendelea. How does it feel? Nafikiri swali lingekuwa zuri sana kwa harmonize kwa sababu me I used to that Diamond ni mtu ambaye anaongea naye na mtu ambaye anaipongeza kila siku. Nikishinda tuzo, nime perform MTV, MTV Vema, nimefanya vitu vingi sana. Yaani toka mimi natoka Diamond ananipongeza. Kwa hata sasa hivi akiniambia ananipongeza, mimi kwangu ni furaha sana. Kitakuwa kitu kipya kwa Harmonize kwa sababu pengine labda kwa kusikia Diamond anaongea hivi karibuni na kumpongeza. Lakini kitu kizuri sana mtu ambaye amewasaidia na mmepata nafasi ana anakuwa proud na nyie naelewa sijui hmm. ni kitu kikubwa sana na kitu kizuri sana kwa sababu ni mtu ambaye ame amewasaidia mpaka sehemu mmefika ni mtu ambaye aliwaona vipaji vyenu na anafurahia so ni kitu kizuri sana so pale uliongea kuhusu calligraph three months ago kasema hiyo beef alikuwa na wachangamsha wasanii hmm. huko hmm. hapa nchini Kenya unatazama kuonana na calligraph Eh hey, karibu tunatamani sana na naye nataka niende hapo kwenye mauru yake. Ni mauru ni nyumba yake ile. <laughs> ha? Kubwa sana. Nimekuuliza swali ile ni mauru ni nyumba yake. Ni mauru nyumba. Mm-hmm. Mwenye anaita mauru. Eh uh-huh, ni nyumba yake. Yeah. You know Kali he's my Yeah 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 he's my brother so lazima niende. Sababu niliona hata ile clip yake. Baki hakuna. Utaenda kuona nyumba. Sijapata ona kuna. So I have to go. He's my brother. Mm-hmm. I think we'll link up. Okay. Yeah. Sure. Ningekuwa ni makosa sana nisipuulize hii swali eh. Ah mm. uh, you are one of the artists ambao yuko kweli amepata kutoka wasafi na tunaona kwamba uh, kimziki unanawiri sana na watu wanakupongeza sana kwa kazi ambayo unapata kuifanya. But pia tungetaka kuongelelea kidogo pia uh, Rich Mavoko kwa sababu tunajua kwamba pia alikuwa one of the artists ambaye alikuwa under wasafi and uh, yeye kujoin wasafi mm watu wengi sana wamepata kusema kwamba wasafi ilipata kumdidimiza mm. kiusanii. Binafsi wewe kama Rivani Vivian Boy, eh? are you planning also to work with the Rich Mavoko and so far tangu yeye kutoka wasafi umejaribu kumtafuta, mfanye naye kitu kwa sababu watu wanaamini wana, wana kwamba yeye pia ni msanii ambaye kwa kweli alikuwa anafanya vyema sana kabla hajaingia wasafi na pia alipokuwa pale wasafi. Mm. Rich Mavoko is my brother na ni mtu ambaye naheshimiana naye sana. Sema watu wanani mimi na Rich Mavoko most of the time. Watu wanana again. Yeye nikisema mara mwisho lini tulionana sikumbuki. Lakini kama tukikutana tunabidi tufanye kazi tutafanya kazi. Na ni mtu ambaye uko talented sana ambaye mmoja siku zote waga na wish. Ningefanya naye hata wimbo mmoja kwa sababu uh, ukiacha ule wimbo ambao tulifanyaga wasafi wote mimi sidhani kama nishafanya wimbo na Rich Mavoko. Ni msanii mzuri lakini nafikiri tukipata time ya kukutana tunaweza tukafanya kazi pamoja ila tujaona na muda mrefu sana. No. No. Message yako kwa kwa yeye binafsi that is Rich Mavoko unaweza mwambia nini? I got love for him you know. He's my brother. We family. Yeah. Jambo jambo linge jambo jambo kwani la kishenzi. Jambo jambo lingine uh, Vivian Boy uh, yeah. umeonekana ni mtu mwenye kufanya creativity kubwa sana katika show. Yeah. Ongera katika hilo pia. Yeah. Na moja kati ya show zako Lakini tunaendelea. Mm. Sijalala siku tatu. Sawa. <laughs> moja kati ya show zako, moja kati ya show zako ambazo ulifanya na baadhi ya mashabiki na watu ambao tunakufuatilia, tuliumia ni ile show ya Mbea, umetengeneza kama swimming pool fulani, oh. eh, kama kakisiwa, alafu mwisho siku akabomoka. Kwanza nataka niulize swali, uwepo wako mapema? Ilibomoka. Ehe. Uwepo wako mapema eh, katika jiji la Nairobi lakini kuelekea Mombasa. Yeah. Ni kuwahi kwa ajili ya hizo creativity zako ambazo always unazifanya katika show, yeah. lakini pia natamani kufahamu katika show ambazo huwa unazifanya na zile creativity ambazo unazifanya gharama zile zinakuwa kwenye kwenye wanandaji show au zinakuwa kwako uh, kwa sasa kuongea sana kuhusiana na gharama zinakuwa upande wa nani lakini mimi waga nataka tu ku deliver kitu kizuri kwa mashabiki wa Revan show umenikumbusha mambo ya, ya, ya pool lile nimeza sana mwa sababu niweka niweka hela nyingi na hela nyingi zikaenda basi gharama ni sasa sijui tuchimbe Mombasa gharama ni sasa chome nyumba au naonaje chome nyumba au tuchome nyumba Mombasa tuchimbe lile tena Mombasa kuna maingini huko wapo wapo wazuri sana wazuri mhm hebu tutajaribu Mombasa tarehe tisa Mombasa tunachimba tena tutachimba usiku tukizungumzia kuhusu next level music Of course tangu tuko wa site watu wamekuwa wakisema kwamba probably Rayvanny anaweza mm. zingatia kufungua radio station ama TV station kama yeah. boss wake. Je, mm. are you planning to open a TV station or radio station? 